Hey everyone, it's me, Jack, here with the first ever segment of Jack's Gems. This is the new segment where I talk about different things that I feel should be a part of everyone's physical collection or should just be treasured and appreciated so that way we can keep a preservation of media going in the physical form and not have everything be digitized and just enjoy it so we can keep it for years to come and own it as we so choose. And the first one I want to talk about is one that I have been waiting a long time to talk about with you guys, but I wasn't quite sure on the way I could talk about it. The Zatoichi Collection from the Criterion Collection. Now, for those who don't know who Zatoichi is, he is a very much folk hero in the realm of Japanese culture. He was a blind samurai who basically roamed the land, sought to help the downtrodden. Think of him as a blind samurai version of Robin Hood. And his many, many adventures are so legendary that other media has copied it and tried refixing it in different forms. Anytime you've ever seen a blind warrior who is just better than everyone at fighting and could be untouchable, came from Zatoichi. Now, it isn't a 100% complete collection because it does leave out the 2003 remake with Takeshi Kitano as Zatoichi, which is a great movie in its own right. However, it is fairly hard to come by as far as a physical media form. Looking at the box, the first thing you notice is a beautiful outward landscape of the artwork itself. Inside of it is a art booklet that has all of the movies in definition, plots, and some little tidbits and notes and treasures about each film. But you want to know about the meat of the product. Well, within there are nine discs containing all 25 films, including a 1978 documentary about the filmmaker and portrayer of Zatoichi, Shintaro Katsu. The Zatoichi collection is a beautiful piece that I feel should be a part of anyone's physical media collection, especially if you love samurai films or old school Japanese media like myself. I highly recommend getting this collection, especially if you like samurai films or just old school Japanese film and media in general. It's currently available by Criterion Collection, which I'm not sponsored by. I highly recommend getting this when it's on its half-off sale because you could get this entire collection during the half-off sale for $100. Normally it goes around from $200 to $300, which is insane. But it is well worth your time and well worth your money.